Hey everyone, I recently picked up three dry shampoos from my local grocery store. They're all pretty affordable. I wanted to try out some new ones after trying out the Psss one. And I really like that one, but I really wanted to try out different ones because there are different scented ones. I'm going to start with this one first. If you're wondering what a dry shampoo is, it's basically what... It sounds like a dry shampoo, you're not going to be washing your hair with water. So you're spritzing this into your hair to help absorb the oil, help freshen up the hair in between washes, and it's perfect for those of you who don't want to wash your hair every day, like myself. Um, if you have like an oily scalp, like my ends are generally pretty dry, especially now that I've colored it, but my scalp get, tends to get oily pretty quickly. Like say your scalp kind of starts to stink a little. It's nice to have a dry shampoo to help freshen up the scent of your hair too. Okay, so this is actually second day hair. I pretty much just want to bring some life back into my roots because, you know, it is starting to get like a bit oily. So I'm just gonna section my hair out. It says to shake the can vigorously. I think it says that. You want to hold it about eight to 10 inches away from your roots and woo, that's a strong spritz. Okay, so I'm trying to take note of what I'm smelling right now. I realize I'm not really fully in frame, so I'm trying to crouch. Um, should have thought this out a little sooner. Okay, so far it smells kind of, kind of fruity. It smells like, kind of like pineapple-y. Yeah, it does smell pineapple. -y. I think I like the scent of it. If you like a fruity scent, I didn't expect a fruity scent from this. I don't know why, um, but as you can see, I'm using the viewfinder as my my mirror, so I'm not even really sure. I'm not even. <laughs> I should grab a mirror so I can see what's going on. So I realized that there wasn't like really any powder coming out. I think it was just slowly like working its way up to, into the nozzle because I was like, I don't really see anything on my hair. But um, now you should see it, especially if you do longer bursts. You should see some powder. So I'm just going through again. Around my face, since I have oily skin, I kind of like to spritz a little around. My hairline too. Okay, and then it just says to, if there's any excess powder, which, let's see if there is. There's some around here. But if you have really oily hair, it's gonna absorb it. You just sort of sift the powder through. And that's pretty much it. So it definitely did give my hair some more body. We're gonna see if, you know, the scent turns because sometimes, you know, some scents like go bad after some time. So we'll see how that smells later on and we'll see how the hair holds up to this dry shampoo. So it has been about seven hours. I definitely did go a little crazy. I, I definitely spritzed a bit too much of the swab dry shampoo into my hair. I can still see like the powderiness, you know, to my hair, um, not all of it got like fully absorbed. It held up pretty well. You feel the, you definitely feel the product in your hair, like it kind of really stiffens your hair. One thing I have to note is that the scent definitely lingered around. It is like very fragrant. So if you don't like the scent, you're not gonna like this dry shampoo because it does linger around. Like I can still smell it. And after really smelling it for a while longer, I was able to assess what it smells like. It smells citrusy, like grapefruity, and it kind of smells like, you know, a tropical, like an orangey, pineapple-y, pretty much like a tropical flavored mixed drink, like an alcoholic beverage. That's what it smells like to me, and it is a very strong scent, and you will either love it or hate it. I do feel like it held up pretty well. I do feel like it gave my hair some body, and I think next time I use it, I'm gonna just try spraying less in and seeing if that helps, but overall, for the price, I would say this is actually pretty good. I mean, it was around like $3. Here are just some final thoughts. I definitely like how affordable this product is and how easily accessible it is. The only thing that may deter me from using it as often is that it does have a strong scent that will linger and it does feel like you put product in your hair so you don't really feel like your hair is clean, but those are just my thoughts. I hope you enjoyed this first impressions video. Let me know if you'd like for me to do more and I'll see you again soon. Bye!